Hey guys, welcome to another video. So this video is like talking about embarrassing stories and like, yeah, and if we have time, possibly reacting to some embarrassing old tweets. Um, so we're gonna start out. This is Katie. Hi. <laughs> Ready to tell you some really, really embarrassing stories. So I guess I'll start. Um, this one, this story isn't really about me. It's about this other girl. I don't really know who it was, but in eighth grade we were playing against this basketball team, okay? And I feel really bad for whoever this was. Um, and we're playing, and all of a sudden I like just get onto the bench to like take a you know a breather, drink of water, right? And I look over, and I see a bloody tampon on the court. On the court, like it fell out of someone and landed <laughs> and I was like oh my god and so I was watching the ref look at it too he literally scoots it away with his foot and off the court and I just I feel really bad for whoever that was because I mean they no one knew who it was but like just think if your tampon fell out while you're playing basketball like poor child <laughs> okay what's your story <laughs> okay so um mine's really embarrassing okay so a couple years ago, I went to the Lake of the Ozarks with my family for 4th of July and I had this um, like bandeau swimsuit top and I was like, I don't know, like 12 so I didn't have big boobs <laughs> to hold the swimsuit up and I was swimming with my uncle and my cousins and my brother and I went down to the bottom of the pool and I like shoot up and <laughs> when I came up my swimsuit top was down. Oh. And my uncle, my uncle told me, oh, it was so embarrassing. So now my family calls me Nip. Oh, <laughs> that reminds me of a story. So I was lifeguarding over the summer. And when you're lifeguarding, our pool is pretty big. So there's multiple of us. And this girl, she was like young, okay? I mean, she wasn't like young, young. She was like fifth grade, maybe. Like, you know, she kind of hit puberty, so um, she was swimming and this poor girl, she had no idea that her swimsuit top was under her boob. Oh, no. So she was swimming with her <laughs> boob out and like, she's too far away for me to tell her. I didn't want to like whistle at her and like be like, you know, swimsuit. And like the same with all the other lifeguards. So we were all just like trying not to look at her and like, we felt really bad. I really wanted to say something, but I couldn't just like scream, you know, across the pool, pull up your swimsuit. Cause, <laughs> but I think eventually she did fix it, but I feel really bad. She had no idea. I feel like I've done that too. I have. Yeah. Oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> do you have another story? I do. Okay, in eighth grade, you know how, or not eighth grade, seventh grade, you know how you go to like field trips? Yeah. To like, um, what is it like Jeff City mm -hmm. okay so I went and I had liked this boy at the time and I had my camera out and um, I was taking pictures of like the like monuments or I don't know what you call it yeah and so he was standing right by me and I had was taking a picture and I was walking there was this huge pole right in front of me and I smacked oh, it Oh, poor baby. And I like hit my head, it hurt so bad. I and I was, I was so embarrassed because he laughed at me. Oh my God. I've done that with a fire hydrant at my school. <laughs> it was hanging on the wall and I went into it when we were lining oh, up. No. I don't know how you feel. <laughs> oh, Katie. Okay, so I have another story. When I was little, um, I think I was like, two three i don't know i can vaguely remember it but i was really little guys just keep that in mind so fam used to love taking me to mcdonald's to play on the play sets and stuff and you know i'd get my mcnuggets and stuff like that and i'd eat it and then i'd go play and i guess i was running around a little too much oh, no. or something i was getting tired or i don't know but i was in i was you know climbing around up in one of the slides and so I was at the top of like the opening of the slide and the inside of the playground and I yacked down the slide. <laughs> the McDonald's guy had I told him went out and told my mom. And then the McDonald's guy had to climb in the playset oh, with his no. mom and mop down the slide. 
food. And I bet I stayed that place up oh with my, like, my big chicken nugget yeah. throw up. It was so bad. But I found that really funny. I was really embarrassed though at the time. I thought we were like in big trouble, you know, with like McDonald's or something. I was like, mom, like, are we banned? Oh my god, that's terrible. <laughs> Okay, do you have any other? No. No, okay, I have a couple others. So, um, oh yeah, Palm Sunday. So I go to church, guys. I'm a Christian, right, right? Jesus. And, <laughs> and I was little and they made us like sing these songs for like Palm Sunday with the palm branches in front of the church. And I think I was like fifth grade maybe? I don't know how old I was. I wasn't like too young. And I had to sneeze so bad. And I was trying to hold it in because I hate sneezing and I had this red jacket with me, okay? So I'm holding this red jacket, I'm holding my palm, I'm waving it, and all of a sudden I just, I had to sneeze. Sneeze, snot, went oh, all no. over my face. I had no tissue, I'm in front of the whole congregation of the church. So I take my red jacket, and this is in the beginning of the song, take my red jacket and I put it over my nose while I'm waving my palm branch the whole time. And everyone's looking at me and then I couldn't no. move or get a tissue. It was so embarrassing. Oh no. I don't think anyone remembers though, so. So my next story is in second grade, I had a crush on this guy. And I thought, you know, why not make him a Valentine's Day card? For Valentine's Day, right? Like, but it wasn't just a normal, like, little candy, like, you know, cartoon one. I was homemade card. And I gave it to him. He looked at it. He threw it away. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it was second grade, so it's whatever. Um, so my next thing is, my cousin, alright, so we made mac and cheese. My cousin dropped um, the mac and cheese from the pot on the ground and then scooped it back in the pot, alright? Oh. I was upstairs, didn't know this. I already had one bowl of mac and cheese, okay? And I was like little. I'm on that little, like maybe 12 or something. Mm -hmm. And I come back down and get another like bowl of mac and cheese and scoop some from the pot. And I'm eating it and I'm like, I pull out a hair. I'm like, okay, weird. Ew. I look down at my mac and cheese. There's specks of black stuff and like dirt and everything on it from the ground. I guess our ground was not really clean, but it was disgusting. Ew. I literally was like, and then I asked my cousin, I was like, would you do the mac and cheese? And she's like, I dropped it. And I was like, you put it back in the pot? Oh, like, no, that's terrible. Do you want to read one of your embarrassing tweets? <laughs> They're so embarrassing. Okay, um. This is a tweet from a while yes. ago. Yes. What is five? May? May? <laughs> Look at me. May 19th, 2016. What is that? That's only two years ago. Yeah. Okay, well, I was what? A sophomore? Right. Yeah, I think. Um, <laughs> so I tweeted. Well, that was rude. <laughs> With no context no, or anything, like nothing. just, well, that was rude. That was it. And then, there was... Oh, that one. <laughs> okay. And she, oh, get this, she put emojis with these yeah. two, like so, laughy faces Yeah, okay, so the one, well, that was rude, that's a laughing face. I can't tell you who that was about. I kind of want to know. <laughs> um, okay, so then, also, on... May 16th, 2016, so just a few days before, I tweeted, LOL, sorry I wasn't good enough for you to be around. And I have the laughing face and then this like, what is that? Like The smooch. The smooch. Without the heart. Yeah. yeah, so don't know who that was for either. I have an idea, but we're not going to say his name. Oh, is it the one? <laughs> I think I might know. I think I was in fourth grade maybe. And I played for this basketball team that wasn't with my school, right? And, you know, in basketball, sometimes you have to backpedal, right? But in this case, there was no need for backpedaling. Just keep that in mind. No need at all. So I think we were going to, we were coming from defense to offense, all right? My team was. And I just decided, you know, I'm going to be really cool, like a really good basketball player. And I'm just going to backpedal all the way to the other <laughs> side. So I started backpedaling down the gym floor. And, you know, mind this, everyone's already down there. And I'm just the only one, like, you know, backpedaling. And I get to the middle of the court, and I fall straight on my butt. And it was really embarrassing. I just get up, and I keep backpedaling backwards. Just think if you saw a kid doing that, though. That's funny. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to pull up some of my tweets now that I screenshotted. I didn't really tweet that much. I'm not a big fan of Twitter. 
I don't know why, I just, I don't know, I can't get into it for some reason. So, 11 slash 5 slash 15, so like November 2015, mm -mm. I tweeted, tweet. <laughs> yeah, it's very original. No. I, I usually just like retweeted stuff, I don't know. Yeah, I did too. Okay, so, 8 slash 16 slash 15 was, and I quote, my teacher gave me P.E. homework, like legit homework on paper about P.E. I don't know why that concerned anyone, but do you want to read one of yours? <laughs> Mine are just about dogs. I have another embarrassing story that I just thought of. Oh, say it. Okay, so freshman year, I ran track and I was in a relay, the 4x2. And I was with a couple girls that weren't like that fast. Like I wasn't that fast either. So like we weren't gonna win. But so I was like, okay, I'm. It's districts, so I'm. There's so many people. I'm like, I'm gonna run really fast. I'm gonna run my fastest. So I am the third leg, and so this the second leg comes and like hands it to me. So then I'm running. I'm running so fast, and I this girl in front of me, the fourth leg, the last one she is standing at the wrong arrow and how track works is like you can't go past the arrow like there's a specific like area where you can't go past so and i'm not allowed to go past the arrow but she is so i had to like lean forward and as i'm leaning forward she moves her hand and may i remind you i'm going full speed she moves her hand i fly forward on my face in front of oh so many God. people and my dad got on video that's oh at least you weren't doing like hurdles and you just like <laughs> went over one that was so scary cool. oh man i want to know who that girl is you're gonna have to tell me i this video <laughs> and if she's watching you know who you, you are know you. <laughs> okay um oh yeah so this one's a really cringy tweet of mine um you know it's from Six slash twenty six slash fifteen. So yeah, mine. That's two thousand fifteen. I was like in eighth grade. Okay, so these are very cringy. So in quotes, that's my girl. So that's in quotes, right? Might be the cutest thing a boy could could say. <laughs> I wasn't even talking to any boys in eighth grade. What? <laughs> like, how would I even? Like, oh, yeah. Also. If I can somehow manage to edit this in, I'm not really good at editing, we'll see. I'll try to put a, a picture in this video of this tweet. But I said, hey, look, I met at Harry Styles. Haha, <laughs> not really a laughy face. And it's the worst photo of me. Photoshopped, I photoshopped this in eighth grade. It's awful Photoshop next to Harry Styles. And it's black and white. And it's just, look at that. It's so bad. That's so funny. I was really proud of it though, so. <laughs> I think you were obsessed with them. Yeah, I still kind of am, like, mm, even though they broke up. Yeah, that's so sad. Yeah, I know. So upset, but at least they all make their own albums they so I can do, listen yeah. to more music. Mm -hmm. It's true. It's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you have any more stories or tweets you want to share? I know you have one, Katie. I tell. have another funny story. Please tell I it. I think of the funny stories. Okay, so when did I, I took... What was it sophomore year backwards? I no, for, no junior year homecoming. I took my friend Tommy to homecoming, and I he's really tall. I remember Tommy. Yeah, I almost called him Toby. <laughs> <laughs> he's really tall, and so I'm I'm not too tall. I'm like five two, and he's like six foot something. So I had to wear really high heels. Okay, junior so was I was. You know how they have like rock stairs like yeah okay so i was walking down those and tommy's next to me and my mom's like oh don't fall and i was like i won't fall i fell oh and my he just Jesus. watched me fall <laughs> oh, he we didn't try to help <laughs> oh my god <laughs> and i had to get back up and i these shoes these shoes were so high but he just watched me fall oh, oh my god I did not see this happen. I kind of wish I did, but oh no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah. there was no one around except for his mom, my mom, him, and me, Aww. and maybe some like other weird people. Did you like scrape yourself or anything? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Well, I think I like 
burns my butt, to be honest. I like, no. I flat. Oh no, that's awful. Yeah, because I liked him, so. Mm. <laughs> it's great. That's all my embarrassing stories. Yes, I think I need to stop. I can't think of really anymore. And some of my tweets are just pointless, like it's my, it's my cat <laughs> or whatever. And I, again, I didn't really tweet that much, you know? Not into Twitter. Maybe I'll get into it someday. Still not into it. Like if you go look at my Twitter, it's just retweets of stupid stuff. Okay, so I think that's gonna be the end of the video. So remember to like and subscribe. Um, links for my social media and stuff are in the description below. Make sure you comment. Tell me, tell us embarrassing yes. stories. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'd love to hear them. Like, mm -hmm. and yeah, that's it. So I'll see you guys next time.